Okay guys, so here's uh, another fun little video. Um, it's now close to 11 p.m. and I have no idea, <laughs> idea where I am. And this is all part of the fun, you know? Um, I managed to find a bar where I could hook into their Wi-Fi and upload videos and do, you know, other things that I needed to do, like emails and whatever. Um, I had a couple of beers and as per usual, when they find out that you're a traveler, you know, they're, <laughs> they're very generous and they give you a whole bunch of other stuff to drink. Um, a lot of it that you've never even heard of before, so I'm not exactly sober right now. And so totally don't know where I am. But as per usual, with a lot of the islands, it was an uphill walk to get to wherever you ended up. So as long as you're going downhill, you're going in the right direction, <laughs> hopefully. So, and this is what it's like when you're traveling. You end up in places and then you forget how to get back to the yacht. So this is exactly that situation right now. So, oh wait a minute, that looks like water down through there, so I'm going to continue just following the streets downhill and eventually I'll get to water and figure it out. And although most people are have gone to their homes and wherever, um, so there won't be too many people on the street, but maybe, oh, wait a minute, oh my god, this is, this is a tree that I saw earlier when I was here hours ago with uh, Scott and, uh, and Maggie, yeah, okay, so, this means I'm close. <laughs> Okay, so we continue to go. We continue to walk downhill. Oh, okay, that's definitely recognizable there. Yeah, yeah, okay. So, I know I'm close. I don't know exactly where I am, but I know I'm close. We're going downhill, heading towards sea level. And that's a good thing. And the air is cooler, so I know I'm approaching water. And there it is. There's water there. So, once I get down to this street here, I may have a better idea of where I am. And with any luck, I'm not too far from the yacht. And if I hadn't had so much alcohol, I may very well recognize more than I do right now. But these stairs seem familiar. Okay, so I'm not at the boardwalk or the the seaside road yet. Looks like I have to go down that way. And then I'll have a better, oh wait a minute, more stairs here. I'll have a better idea of which way to go, hopefully.
Okay, let's see. Okay, I'm at a coastal road. No, let's have a look around. Let's see if I recognize anything. Yes, okay, I recognize that tower. I don't know if you can see the red lights on that tower in the background. That looks familiar. Anything else that looks familiar? Okay. Instinctively, I think I should walk this way. Let's see if there's anything else that I recognize here. another little restaurant that appears to be open so I should make a note of this Tintina okay Here's another place, Maria Bonita, it seems to be open. So a couple of places on the, uh, on the coastal road anyway, that seem to be open later. And in the distance there, I see a whole bunch of sailboat masts, so that's a good sign. So I'm pretty sure I'm heading in the right direction. Yeah, so I think what I did was I went up into the city further ahead and I just came out further down that way. Yeah, so I definitely recognize that tower with the red lights. Okay, I see something else that I recognize too those shorter, bigger towers there. And this is how it goes. Any country. That you visit, it's the same thing. Well, for me anyway, with these yacht deliveries. You always manage to find your way back. As you develop a, a sort of a sense of direction. when you uh, visit enough places. Yeah, none of this is familiar because I came out a fair distance away from where I started.
but I did. Yeah, okay, everything's cool. I did make it a point to look for certain landmarks, and definitely that tower with the red lights on the top is one of them. And then this place here, I don't know if you can hear really, you can see it, but the short white tower is there. Uh, Comex, I think it says on. <laughs> I use those as my reference point to remember to get back. And yes, okay, and of course I recognize that cupola there. Looks like the top of a church. And this is all part of the fun. And it works every time, if you remember to make a note of uh, some major landmarks, towers, buildings, etc. You always make your way back. said like I have said in other videos try not to do this alone guys it's much nicer if you have someone in your life you can share this with because it's a blast it really is So we're here for at least another four days or so, maybe more, because there are some major repairs that have to be done to the yacht. So I may very well rent a car and then I can bomb all over the island and see all parts of it. I think it's uh, 25 euros a day like the cheapest car they have compact car whatever it's called Okay, so I made it. I can see the yacht, but I can also see the uh, the uh, little red rental car that the owners of the yacht had. And they just left it there. And the people from the rental company will come and pick it up, that little red car there. And that's the yacht. So, we made it.
lights are off, so no doubt they're sleeping. So I'll quietly get on board and get into my own cabin and go to sleep. Okay, so this is my yacht. So I'll end it here.